This video is sponsored by Grammarly. Hi. Hi. So, basically... Hi, sisters! Ah! The canted slanted camera angle represents the mess of my schooling at the moment. Guys, I know you think I'm a good student, and I am a good student. But recently, I have not been a good student. I've not been on top of my work because I've been incredibly busy. Lockdown definitely threw me off my A-game a lot. But it's fine. You know why it's fine? Because I always pull through no matter what. And I'm going to show you how I do that today. I just never stress because I know I got this. I'm in my final semester of college, university at the moment, and then I'm graduating with a degree, with a Bachelor of Science in Psychology and Marketing. Because of COVID, we've still been doing our courses online, which is so heartbreaking because literally the past two years, I've done all of my courses online and I will never get this like on-campus college experience ever again. <laughs> oh, getting a little emotional. No, I'm not. I actually haven't watched any lectures the whole semester. Luckily, I'm only doing one course, so I can catch up. I really would not recommend you guys cram if you have more than one course, because I absolutely would not do that. If I had more than one course, I would drop dead. Couldn't do it. So, I have a strategic plan of action today. I'm going to bring you through with me. We got the exam tomorrow. I'm very confident that I'm going to be okay. And you know why I'm confident? Because of Grammarly. Before we continue, I want to talk about my favorite tool, Grammarly, which is brilliant for if you have exams coming up. So I highly recommend you download Grammarly because Grammarly is so brilliant for this exam season. I wouldn't be able to get through it without it. It's an all-in-one writing tool that improves your writing, your productivity, and saves you time. It's all in one little extension on the Chrome store. It's super easy to download. Just head over to the Chrome store, type in Grammarly, and download it from there. It also works where you work. So if you use Google Docs, Grammarly will appear there and will help you save even more time, proofread your work, and a bunch of other features. So if you want to succeed in college and work more efficiently with Grammarly's free features, you can number one, use their settings goal feature, which is going to help you save time writing your assignments. And also make sure that you're writing for the right audience, which is so helpful because sometimes you can really go off track and then you'll lose marks, but uh -uh, Grammarly helps you stay on track there. Number two, Grammarly has a free word count feature. So you always know how many words you need or if you're going over or under, it's just brilliant to have. And number three, Grammarly also has a synonym feature. So you don't need to go to other websites to look for replacement words. It's all right there on Grammarly's free version. Grammarly is so great for me during exams just because everything is all in one and I save so much time because I don't need to go to other websites to find information or to find a replacement word. Grammarly just does it all for me. You guys, I highly recommend it. So with midterms and assignments coming up, why not download Grammarly now? You can sign up for a free account at my link right here and you'll get 20% off. Just go to grammarly.com slash Simone Squared. Step number one, get some motivation. Do you want to die? Do you want to be laughed at by me? Do you believe that you can do anything you put your mind to? No. You don't? No. Well, I believe you can. I don't. With me and my study method, for only $9.99 a month, I'll show you how to do it. I'm kidding. I actually found like funny motivation yesterday on TikTok and it was like, you want to be like Rory Gilmore? Well, Rory Gilmore would use you as study inspo because you're in your lazy ass all day doing nothing. Step number two, this is the most important part. You need to go through your syllabus and figure out what you know, what you don't know. If you're like me, you don't really know anything. One hour, you're gonna do week one. Next hour, you're gonna do week two and you're not gonna watch the whole lecture. You're gonna two times speed it. If you don't have time for that, you're just gonna get the PowerPoint and then you're gonna read through it and then you'll do the readings. But when you do the readings, you're not gonna do all of it. You only read the little abstract. Something else you can do is Join like group chats and just ask around for other people's notes. You can probably Google your uni and the course and notes will come up as well. That's very helpful, especially if you have a very difficult class to do. If you're like me and you struggle to concentrate, you can also go to the library. Once you've kind of skimmed all of the content and you've made your notes, now's the time for consolidation. If you don't want to cheat, I'm kidding. Read your notes aloud. I talk about this all the time speeches and then that's it i do a speech and we're done
You know what? I literally can't concentrate. I can't concentrate. I don't know if you guys get this, but when I don't feel urgency for something and I just have like this inherent calm feeling that everything's going to be okay, I just... My fight or flight doesn't kick in. Like in the past, I used to rely on my fight or flight before an exam to kick in because then I'll be like, oh my god, I gotta study, otherwise I'm gonna fail. It's never kicked in. It's literally never kicked in. I feel like my fight or flight's broken because I don't panic ever. I just somehow know everything's gonna be okay. And then you know what? Sometimes it's not. <laughs> but in the end, it's okay. <laughs> You know what? <laughs> I'm gonna go to the library. I'm gonna go to the library. finished all the lectures i kind of skipped through them made my notes gonna get lunch now gonna go home i spent about half the duration here on my phone these are so bad for you i'm actually eating them right now yummy so these are my instant noodles with i put i put like two eggs in here i put two eggs in here out of some spinach uh fuego don't get it twisted i'm usually incredibly stressed during exams especially when i haven't done a lot but today i'm very calm just because i know this subject is very easy and i'm the ceo of cramming so you know take it with a grain of salt in my more difficult subjects i would absolutely if i was cramming start studying and maybe like 6 a.m. and I absolutely would not have a break and I absolutely would not vlog it because I need my full attention on the subject but don't need it today so I'm gonna watch Lock and Key bye I just had a big meal as well so I'm very tired and I'm listening to Cinnamon Girl I'm also listening to some binaural beats <laughs> 30 minutes later oh God, it's time to study. I'm so over this. I'm so over it. I'm so tired. Does anyone else fall into a deep sleep at like maybe two o'clock? I think I'm anemic. I think I'm anemic. Anyway. This is my fashion break. I just got this dress in the mail from Revolve and I had to show you how beautiful it is. And I also got this one, but it's a little bit big. So I have to return it for a smaller one. Okay, it's 6.47. The sun is nearly gone. The sun is nearly gone. The lights are turning on. The silver shine that stretches to the sea. Some other girl and guy will love the sun and moon, but there's only you and I. Okay, whatever. I've literally been studying the entire time. I'm lying. From maybe 9 a.m. to 7. We've done the speeches, we've done the quizzes, we've done the notes. I feel like everything's honestly really consolidated in my brain. My fight or flight has not kicked in. I swear to God, you guys, you do your summaries, you do the speeches, you consolidate. You're good. You're good. Wow. 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 Charming not only did Simone pass her exam, but she got a distinction. She is proof anything is possible and download Grammarly. People love each other. The world would be a better place to live. Roman, Roman, vacacion. <laughs> Mi hada madrina dijo que sí. Este de aquí me hizo llorar. Este otro me dice marica. Este otro de mí piensa mal. Esto es lo que hago cuando me chingan. Wow. Wow.
gonna be our honeymoon. <laughs> wow! Wow! Yeah! Wow! Right? Yeah. Great. Thanks. Amazing.